Welcome to this video. In this video, I would like to show you how you can get a easily a list of all the executable transactions or so all the transactions that a user is authorized to execute. And this can be done really, really easily with the transaction SUIM. So the user information system, then you can choose transactions and then executable transactions, all selection options. So once you um, uh, choose this, then within here, you can type in the SAP user to whom you would like to check what kind of transactions he or she is allowed to execute. And then you can can just simply hit the execute button or the F8 key on your keyboard. Then yeah, in the background, all the transactions will be selected. This takes a couple of seconds. And then right now here, you will get a list of the transactions this user is allowed to execute. And if you want to, you can also export this uh, this list and yeah, do some, some analysis within here. Um, yeah, and if we're going a couple of steps back, then with this executable for user, then you simply have just exactly the same option, but within here, just the option user is able. I will put also the two transaction codes within the video description. So if I, for example, execute this one, then I will just see the option for the user. And if I execute this transaction code, then I will have all the options available. So yeah, keep this in mind. This is, I think, a really nice trick. You can do exactly the same. So all the executable transactions for the roles, for profiles, for specific authorization. And this is, I think, a really nice tip and trick for SAP security. Yeah, and if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you have any questions or comments, please put them in the comment section and please subscribe this YouTube channel to never miss great upcoming videos and support my work. Thank you so much and then see you in the next video.